I, Why? I'm trying not to, but uh, let's see what happens. And in fact, you know, if you're in your car, uh, KNX 1070 will have all the updated information. But before you go, uh, we'll keep you updated on how it looks well, out there and what kind of routes you can take. It's it's really going to be nuts. Tons of coverage here on the KKL 9 or sister station CBS 2. Mm -hmm. I'll be here <laughs> someday yeah. telling you to stay home. And I'll be and watching you from home. <laughs> Great weekend to be stuck in traffic, though, won't it? Yeah, why not? You know, it's going to be a little warmer as long as your AC is working. It's a good weekend to be right. stuck in traffic. So make sure you got your AC cranking because they're going to be sitting on those freeways for a while, probably, right? That's what we're guessing. Uh, but then again, there's the theory that, well, what if everybody gets scared and nobody goes out and broke? Well, for some reason, I don't think that's going to happen to this town. <laughs> Call me and let me know, would you? <laughs> I know, right? I'll, I'll keep you posted. Uh, but yeah, we are getting a look outside right now. You'll see our Mount Wilson camera. Gorgeous shot for us this evening. A little bit of cloud cover off there in the distance, but for the most part, it's clear and it's mild. But we are bracing for more cloud cover into the overnight hours and the morning hours as well, maybe even a chance of drizzle. So today was up to 76 degrees. That's below average. Average is about 84. This is for the base for downtown in particular. Record temperature is 98. Didn't get anywhere close to that. Not getting anywhere close to that over the next few days. In fact, getting cooler over the next 24 hours. Down to the 60s, mid 60s. First thing in the morning by the afternoon. We're up to the mid 70s. So again, it's still below average, but still keeping temperatures pretty mild. And do want to mention a chance of drizzle, not only along the coast, but in the basin and in the valleys first thing in the morning as we head into tomorrow. So you'll see right here, low pressure, that's dominating. And what's happening because of that? Well, we're seeing that AM low cloud cover, overnight clouds and fog, and a chance of morning drizzle over the next couple of mornings, then a warmer weekend on tap as, well, that ridge of high pressure rebuilds into the forecast. So future cast showing you 545 tomorrow morning. Take a look, even a little bit of drizzle potentially in the forecast for you already by 11 o'clock. We're still dealing with fog, but that marine layer is starting to mix out quite a bit. And as we carry on through about the 4 o'clock hour, at quarter to 5 tomorrow afternoon, just before the evening hours, still dealing with a little bit of fog sitting off the coast, and that's going to push its way right back into Southern California as we head into the overnight hours. So again, a cooler and a cloudier forecast as that trough of low pressure continues to dig into Southern California over the next few days. Again, that's what's prompting the cooler weather. That's what's pr prompting the cloudier weather. That's what's prompting that chance of drizzle as we head into the next couple of days as well. And you'll see that in your five-day forecast right here. We'll show you your five-day forecast for the basin in Orange County. Mid-70s, remember, average is low 80s, so we're certainly below average all week long. Dealing with that chance of drizzle for the next couple of days by Friday, partly cloudy. A little more sunshine, a little warmer by Saturday, and a little warmer. In fact, hitting 80 degrees by the time we hit Sunday. Reagan Lena, back to you.